Hello. Hi. I think this is season two, episode eight. That I have no idea. Sure. <laughs> I think so, because uh, I just made a YouTube playlist. So if you're watching and you want to see some of the past ones, you can go on YouTube. There's a whole playlist on YouTube and on Facebook <laughs> for this whole season of Rapping with the Registrar. <laughs> I just can't imagine like people wanting to go back and watch them. Well, there's important information <laughs> That in is there. true. That is true. And then like, you... oh, man, she only gets more awkward every week. And sometimes we talk about stuff that does nothing to do with commencement, so it's those little Easter eggs. I know. I need to try and mention corn dogs this time. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag, those corn dogs were great, by they the were, way. They were, and they were full-size corn dogs, too. Not many corn dogs. They were full-size corn dogs. Maybe you can uh, talk to Catering and get them over at the Carlson Center on May 4th for... Uh, oh, I don't want to make any promises on that, but... <laughs> Anyway, commencement is coming up. We are in the final countdown for about six, seven weeks away yeah, are, or something like today? that. Yeah, what's today? March Today's March 19th. 19th. And commencement is May 4th. So, yeah, we're looking at, like, what, six weeks or so? Yeah. And there's still a series of deadlines coming up for people who are graduating and want to walk in and take part in the commencement yes. ceremony this year. So the most important one for this week, the most important deadline is your deadline to order regalia is March 24th. So that's Sunday. Um, so make sure to order your regalia by then. If you plan on walking in commencement, order it by Sunday. So go online, bookstore website, and you can just click through there. Yep. Steve's if, also got an email today. So all of the links to, to order are in the email that you should have gotten today. If I was a, a freshman, I'm just starting out, but I'm really excited about commencement in a few years. <laughs> can I order my regalia right now? Uh, <laughs> your tassel will have the wrong number on it because all the tassels for this year are going to have oh. a 19. Uh, but so yeah, your tassel would be wrong. But it's usually always the same black cap and gown. So. so so if I've got tons of money, I could order a tassel every single year that I go to school, I, and then when I graduate, yeah. I could have all the tassels on my cap. I, that I guess is something you could do. I don't think I've seen anyone do that yet. So that would be a first. All right. So word out there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you are, you yourself are going through the commencement process this year. You are graduating. You've got a, a graduate mm -hmm. degree that you're receiving. Uh, has there been roadblocks or obstacles in your way that you wish you knew about to avoid? Uh, no, not really. It's been pretty smooth. Maybe I have kind of, you know, the insider, you know, knowledge of it. But it's, yeah, been pretty a pretty easy process. I got my regalia ordered, and I know when and where to be on the day of. Uh, the commencement website is a very useful tool, so it has all the information you need. Uh, I think you always post the link in there to I the do. comments. So, I do. Yeah, that website has all the information that you need about commencement. If for some reason there's not something there that you're looking for, um, just send us an email or call our office and we're more than happy to answer any questions for you. And there's talk this year about the UAF's association with the Carlson Center and stuff like that, but it is in the Carlson yes, Center for Yes, it's at the Carlson Center, um, yeah, on May 4th. Doors open at noon. And then, uh, so you can stay upstairs, and then your friends and your family can come and yep. sit down there. Um, is there any change to the run of show, to the order of how things are going? Sometimes, Not last year, year, I think, went pretty fast. Well, yeah, it did. Last year, I think it was two hours and 45 minutes. So mm -hmm. it was like record speed last year. The year before, I think, was over four hours. So, yeah, that one, some dark days on that one. <laughs> that one was a rough one. But, uh, no, yeah, we've gotten it to where we've shaved it down pretty good. And uh, there's no big changes this year or anything. So, yeah, hopefully. Hopefully it all runs smooth and we get under three hours again as the goal. And then you get in there, you get, and then that afternoon is always a blur because you just, you realize all the work that you've done has come to an end. And yep, yeah, your you're done. And yeah, by the time commencement rolls around, finals are over. So you are hopefully in the clear. You just need to wait for your grades to post. <laughs> so um, I like to bring up every week that if there is paperwork you need to turn in, get it done soon. Waivers. Yeah, so if like there's that. any paperwork you need to do, you know, um, for our graduate students, comp exams or defenses, um, those need to get turned in uh, for undergraduates, you know, petition forms, uh, change of major. For some reason, you're not in your major. <laughs> you should be in that by now, though. Um, but the main one is petition forms or um, advisor approved memos. Those need for your electives, uh, if your major requires certain electives. Then that, all that paperwork is due by May 8th. Okay, so that's that. Oh, by May eighth. Yeah, the last. So day even grades, after. Yeah, the last day grades are due is the last day to yeah get in all your paperwork for graduate students. The deadline for their comp exam and defense is a little different. That's earlier. You'd want to refer to the grad uh, school website on. I think it's April twenty fourth is when all of that paperwork is due. So just make sure talk to your advisor. Yeah. And, and about make you know do I have everything I need? Mm -hmm. Yeah, if your major is one um, like mechanical engineering, they have like a tech elective that needs to be advisor approved. Um, so the advisor has to fill out 
a memo or an e-form to let us know what that elective is. And yeah, so by May 8th is when all of that stuff is due. And there's links on the website you can click through and send mm -hmm. an email or ask people about what's going on and you can always get in touch with Haley. Yep. 24-7. Well, not 24-7, but eight, <laughs> 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. <laughs> That's when the email is open. Yeah, I usually do check my email. So if it's a good, you know, an easy question I can answer off the top of my head, I'm more than happy to. And I know that you like to give this tip Library science. Library science, yes, that is always one too. So yeah, don't wait until the end of the semester. Do it as quickly, you know, as soon here as you can because, yeah, you don't want to wait for the very end of the semester. But yeah, um, your test scores for that are also due uh, by the end of the semester. Thank you very much, Haley, and we'll talk again next week. Yep, and don't forget to order your regalia. By March, Sunday. March 24th. Yes. Is the, it's a hard deadline. There's no late ordering. Um, well, I don't really want to say anything. Oh, <laughs> I don't okay. want people to try and order by March 24th. Order by March 24th. Um, but yeah, the, you know, if for some reason you do miss that deadline, there was a little bit of confusion on that because originally the deadline was printed as April 1st, and then I guess we got word from uh, the people that sell the regalia that it's actually March 24th. So there is a little, yeah, discrepancy in there. But if you miss that March 24th deadline, um, contact the bookstore and they uh, should be able to help you out. You might have to pay a little bit for expedited shipping, so try and save yourself that money on the expedited shipping. And that's Sunday. Just order it and then yep. you can get billed for it later. And yeah, you don't have to pay for it at the time that you order it. You pay for it when you pick up at the bookstore. And I do know from experience that it is a pretty emotional moment when you go <laughs> and you collect your regalia. It's like, oh my gosh, this is really happening. Yeah. So, yeah, we don't want anyone to, yeah, not get their cap and gown, so make sure to order it. All right. Thanks, Haley. Thanks.